So now what I'm doing is now that I've got it roughed in, yeah, yes, that is roughed in, I'm working my way backwards and forwards, up and down, until I get the end result that I'm looking for. And when it's right, what will happen is the bubble will stay in the same position all the way up and down the bed. And it's just a matter of patience. And you'll need a lot of it. spot on at this end. Um, so what that would indicate is that we have too much pressure on the feet at the end of the headstock because what it's doing is this is the outside end of the headstock and we're low just forward of it so what it's done is it's put a slight bend in the headstock right in the bed or the headstock. One, two, three divisions. We're all in the middle. One division. All right, let's put some pressure. Putting some pressure on the inner headstock bolts. No, wrong way, you fool. Actually looking close there, that was within one division. Oop, too far. Let's see where we are now. Let's leave a little bit more off here.
Another problem we've got here is too is that what you actually start looking at is you start looking at the uh, wear in the beds or any machining inaccuracies or So at the moment we're we've got two divisions. So that's four hundredths of a metre. One division the other way, so we're actually three divisions variation, so that's six hundredths in a metre. Now, let's just ease a fraction of pressure off here. got it back to zero there. I'm just reading one end of the bubble. This one, but it just makes it easier to read. So looking at this end of the bubble, this end of the bubble is on zero at that end and it's on three at this end, so that's six hundredths. So, it's high here. That's within half a division, I'm not going to worry about that. That's within one hundredth in a metre. the same again.
And so we'll keep doing this for a while. There's no need for you to stand here and watch me. I'll let you know when I'm finished.